Hi friends, I'm Colonel Failure. Welcome to Guadalajara. Yeah, uh, I've been uh, I've been tinkering uh, since the last time we were here together, speaking to one another in that way that we do, and uh, and I've built uh, I built tram set up in Guadalajara as well because it felt like that would move things forward. I, I, I want to try and uh, uh, and I don't know uh, push the envelope a little every time that we uh, we meet one another. Why are you waiting there, Tiger? You shouldn't be waiting. You should be able to just fly like a bird and, uh, and arrive in the station without too much problemo. Hmm. Okay, well, I mean, I guess it's working. I mean, maybe there's there's some junctioning uh, hassles going on. I've created some junctioning hassles here. Uh, this was... This was a, an error in judgment uh, that uh, that didn't pay off brilliantly. If I can... No, 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 no. Selection. Yeah, grab that. And then grab this bit. I found out how to bulldoze. Um, but it's it's it can be a little on the fussy side. Uh, I want... No, I'll just see. What you have to do is you have to grab those bits. But I need that bit. Or do I? Yes, I do. I need that bit, but do I need this bit? Uh, or that bit? You've got to see. You have to. You have to do. You've got to. You, you have to. You see. You. You've got to. And then. You got to. And. Uh, and so. All right, I gave up on that because I'll have to rebuild it all, and and there'll be all manner of faffing around going on. Uh, originally. Uh, I had this uh, this inner loop uh, doing uh, doing loops around the interior, but then backing up out of that one, going to this one, backing up to get back onto the line there, and it caused gridlock. So uh, so I built a second. Uh, wait for it. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Uh, I built a second platform. Yeah, and so they go around that way now, uh, and so it's got a little bubble on the end of it, which is why it's called the Guadalajara Bullseye. It's not really like a bullseye, but it felt like an appropriate name when I uh, when I came up with it, and it's it's kind of stuck. Yeah, you see, look, you're being blocked by traffic coming the other way because of this flipping horrendous effigy going on there. I'll fix it. Uh, anyway, it's a Tuesday currently, uh, and you kind of go, okay, one point one in tickets. Uh, that's uh, that's respectable. Yeah, but look at yesterday. Uh, yesterday, three point two million in tickets. Ho, 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 ho. Ah, yes, that would be the stuff. Uh, we'll probably end up in a similar situation today, I'll be honest. Although saying that, we've only got six hours left to go in, in what is effectively Monday. Our accounting period finishes at 6am, because all the times are in UTC. Um, and we're looking at it in Mexico. It's complicated, just get your head around it. Um, yeah, no, I don't think we are going to break through it. And oh no, that's because for a, a good 50% of the day, we were in gridlock here. So we're not going to do the same uh, amount of money today. Uh, but if we go down the individual lines uh, into accounting, yeah, you, the, the, there's a, a few problems going on there. But the bullseye has done almost 200 grand today, having been unscrewed. Uh, the perimeter's done 364. Uh, perimeter 2 did 364. This was yesterday, incidentally. Uh, 379. Uh, on the uh, on the other perimeter, uh, the Mexico City uh, Central Line, four hundred grand, seven hundred and sixty grand on the circle, and seven hundred grand on the circle that is slightly narrower because obviously going around the outside it's slightly further, so you have to pay a higher ticket price. Madness, but there it is. the uh, The pricing that I'm using is is one buck per kilometer, no matter where you are traveling, and it works. It, it's it's paying off. I'm making money. It's all grand. Now, I'm going to run up to a point pretty pretty much today uh, where uh, where I rinse the remainder of my budget. I don't even know how far I'm going to get, I'll be honest. Uh, but uh, how's about we go and find out? Because we're going to try and run a uh, an express line service from Mexico City out to Guadalajara. <laughs> which might be something large that I've bitten off, uh, but we'll uh, we'll see how she blows. Uh, right, okay, let's uh, let's rock and roll. Now the uh, the goal here is a simple one. No, we want two. Right, we don't want trams. Uh, we want to we want to immediately hit ourselves up with uh, 
with this lot. Now, I, I did notice actually, because I built a, a section not so long ago that actually bridges, uh, where are I? One overpass, million quid. It's a million quid a bridge. Those add up, uh, which is why I've built my, uh, my main connections external to the town. Because look, there's another one. That's another million quid. Um, yeah, it's, it's not ideal. Uh, we're going to try and run at, uh, at maximum speed as much as possible. I don't want to go through there. That's going to be flaming expensive. Why did I build here? What the heck was I thinking? Um, uh, what are my alternatives? We could go straight over this. I'm assuming the word solar there means that this is some kind of solar array. I didn't think that we'd built any of those yet as a species outside of, you know, a couple of big implantments. But maybe we have. Um, and maybe one of the big implantments is here in Mexico. It would be a good place for it. Now, if we go through this way, we've got this, I'm going to say forest, uh, that is going to be free to uh, to run through. Uh, we're going to actually, I'm, I'm actually going to survey this, this route. I've tried crow flyzing it, and it just doesn't give you enough information. Um... So we go through there. Then you've got a whole bunch of business to get out, get through. And then, I don't know, kind of track the course of this river. That might work. Yeah, And, and then see, look how far we've still got to go. <laughs> uh, uh, we're not going to get this done. No, no, no. no. I'm going to run out of money a long time before we get there. Um, but the, the, the good news, such as it is, is that... Uh, no, 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 no. This is a control Z moment. There you go. Right, try doing this instead. All right, well, it doesn't seem to be... Okay, maybe it's a little bit bothered about getting over there. Um, uh, yeah, no. Well, you know, we'll we'll see how it goes. I did a bit of a measure up last time, and, uh, and it is about 250 kilometers, which is great because it means the ticket price will be a bonanza. Um, it's less great because uh, it's a... Very, very long way to go. 187. Right, let's not drop below that. Uh, I ideally, I want to be up in the 350s most of the time. Well, look, why don't you draw a straight line? If you would go out that way, yeah, there's a, there's a fair bit. Of, actually, you've got a you've got a wiggler going through there. You could get through that and this and that. Okay, all right, okay. So we're aiming for aiming for Chapa de Mota to start with. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's go. Let's let's, let's do this. Uh, I don't even know what this blue thing is, but uh, it's got a lot of ridges, but fewer ridges than if we were to go uh, surface streets with it. Let's do it. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Sorry. I had to make an executive decision there, and uh, and that's all good. Now I could just. That hold on, whoa, 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 whoa. if we're doing a million, if we're doing a million quid a bridge, how much is a viaduct? I'm gonna have to back this up anyway, but uh, viaduct is is a million quid per hundred meters. It looks like, yeah, which is basically the same cost as a bridge. All right, all right, fine, 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 fine. Think it through which way you're going. I mean, the, the alternative would be to work our way outside and then bend round, but frankly, no. So we'll, we'll just do this. All right, I'll be back when I've made a smidge of progress. Yeah, I've been busy. Yeah, that's, uh, that's the thing that's happened. Uh, as you can see, uh, the uh, the totalizer for Thursday coming in at currently uh, uh, 2.7 million. And there's quite a lot of Thursday still to go. Uh, Wednesday, we finished on 2.8 million. And uh, Tuesday, we were down a little bit, ah, but not downhearted. And that's the important thing. Uh, Monday, we, we were down a lot. Obviously, uh, you can get quite a lot done in quite a short amount of time. But the good news is that this level of profit uh, means that uh, not only can I pay back uh, my loan without uh, without any hassle at all, but I'm also turning, uh, you know, 30, 40 million a year, uh, a year, a month um, in uh, in revenue that can be then spent again. The problem with that is I've I've marked out a bit of track. Now this is not an insignificant bit of track. I've it, it, I haven't paid for it yet. It's two hundred and twenty-six million. 
Yeah. Uh, so, you know, we run down here. It's it's doing maximum speed as much as possible. We've got a little bit of a bleed off there, but it's still over 300k. No, we've got none, actually. That's a, that's a good good bit of corner. Uh, 350, uh, which is the max speed you can go anywhere. Um, I've got another safety tip for you. Uh, other than avoid water. Avoid water. Uh, 350, 350, 350. More bridges. Eh, can't be avoided. Um, I'll show you why we've gone this route in a moment. Uh, more 350s. Just pain. Um, and then uh, a 322, because we had to get around the corner. Going alongside the lake. And then we take an abrupt turn across the lake to do a viaduct. Couldn't do it any other way. Well, that, well, there, there's myriad other ways that it could have been done, uh, but this was the one that's the best. Here's the thing: top speed on a bridge, 249. Yeah. So, uh, so it's also so if you're going to viaduct, get your get your corners in at the same time. If you're going to lose speed, you might as well lose as much speed as you need to be oriented in the right direction. Um, and then bridge, 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 flipping bridges everywhere. We keep going round. More bridges, obviously. We keep going, keep going round, and here we go. Did you want to see how far we've actually gone? Because it's not much. There we go. We made it up past Zampango, and that's where we're going. And that's a quarter of a billion quid. Okay, then. Um, good news, such as it is, so far, is uh, it hasn't complained about me going through this uh, this hillside. Uh, it's it's priced that at the same amount as, uh, as as open ground. That's something that at least at least we have that going in our favor. There we go, two point eight million again. Yet the previous day, two eight two five today 2833 it's not good is it it's i mean it's good but it's not good enough so i'm debating currently and uh, i think i know which way i'm going to go uh, uh actually bulldozing all of this lot now i did try uh going directly across the uh de deposito de evaporation solar el caracol um but i got as far as here before hitting the 200 million mark yeah so I went, no, avoid going through people's houses. It's not the houses that are the problem, it's the bridges. Uh, the, the endless bridges will, an overpass is absolutely horrendous. As you can see, uh, I spent 90, I spent almost half the budget there to go over 93 overpasses. Now, the good news is 104 kilometers in length. That's the end of the good news. So, uh, so no, let's, uh, let's, will it do it from this angle or do I have to go in a bit further? I don't know if it will do it at all. There we go. There we go. Yeah, so we got some, you've got to be able to see the end of the, the track bit. No, look, I built it once. I can build it again. I have a plan B. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. That's it. Go on. Back her up from some bango. Uh, the plan B is, is going to be a lot like plan A. We'll probably go this way, but what you don't have is an actual bulldozer whereby one can actually bulldoze actual streets and stuff. Yeah, you know, that's, that's that's a luxury item that you don't have, and I really miss it. Uh, yeah, okay, that's fine. There we go. Right, that's undone. That. Here's the new plan. The new plan is more tram routes frankly uh if that they're, they're proving to be a nice little earner the only uh, real downside to it is that the trains themselves are 11 million quid that's three trains a month uh on the on the current amount that i'm making no it's it's awful so i think what i'm going to probably end up doing is uh i'll do one more part of this at least um is uh, is i'll build as many more tram routes as i can it might be one city might be two uh, and uh, then leave it running overnight. <laughs> yeah, could have gone for infinite cash, but where's the where's the fun in infinite cash? You just uh, you, you viaduct everywhere or tunnel. Uh, tunnels, you're you're limited by speed even more. I think it was two hundred you're limited to. Uh, I'll, I'll I'll find out. Hang on. Uh, where we go? Where we go? This and tunnels, and you're looking at the wrong building. There you go. Uh, we're over here. So if I go tunnel in a straight line, it tops out at 300, 300, not 200. So tunnels are slightly faster, 
but uh, there we go. That's uh, hold on. Well, no, 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 let's do some science, right? Here we go. Is uh, is tram track, right? And we'll go from there to about the lake. All right. So tram track. That'll set you back. Let's go to about there. All right. This is not going to be a hundred percent precise. Actually, no. Let's let's make it precise. No, let's do it. Better idea. I'm going to do exactly a thousand meters. There you go. Uh, or close to it. There you go. That's a thousand meters of tram track. Seven hundred grand. It says two two thousand meters. That's because it's two sets of track. Oh, so when I said I'd gone a hundred kilometers, I'd gone fifty. That's nice. Uh, right. Okay. Right. And then ground similar length. Well, no, we'll go the same length. A thousand meters, please. A uh, thousand meters. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Ground. Thousand meters is uh, is two million quid. All right. Okay. All right. Viaduct. All right. Okay. Here we go. Yeah. Give me up to a thousand meters, please. A thousand meters. Yep. Eighteen million quid. Oh, that's, that's a bit. That's a bit steeper, I suppose. Uh, and then, uh, and then the tunnel, uh, as you can see, it's already coming in at a whacking great twenty-three million bucks. There. Yeah. So tunnels really aren't on the menu, um, unless unless you have a, a burning desire to uh, to see your bank balance evaporate before your very eyes. You might have that uh, desire. I recommend against it. So here's the plan. Uh, we've got Mexico City. We've got, uh, we've got Guadalajara. Where next? Now, we've got a whole bunch of... Hold on, hold on. Let's do a quick, uh, let's do a quick test since I'm in a uh, testing kind of a place. Ground, yeah. Just hold on, zoom in. And all of that. Okay. That's 11,000 metres, 11 million quid. All right, obviously, that's it's half that much because uh, of reason. I could go straight over the mountains. All right, I mean you can argue about realism for for as much as you like there, but uh, honestly, I'll take it. Right, in that case, maybe we go. I mean, you've got to think about how affordable it is uh, to actually get there in the first place. I'd uh, undo that, please. And I'll zoom in, zoom in, undo. Right. Now, we've got over here, let's have a look. So, uh, Tuxpan and San Vincent is uh, small. Yeah, Ruiz is small. Uh, Santiago Ixquintala. That's how it's pronounced. Um, small. No, none of these are big enough. Uh, I was, I was kind of hoping that Tuxpan would do the job. What about uh, Rosa Medora here? Negligible. Oh, poo. Uh, Santa Cruz. Yeah, dream on. Okay. Uh, Tepic. What? Oh, come on, Tepic. Tepic. There you go. That's the bunny. Right. Tepic is going to be our next stop, or maybe Santa Maria. No, because that's Santa Maria del Oro, and uh, that's not the same kind of deal. All right. So we'll go for we'll go for Tepic for our uh, for our next stop, and we're still not out of Mexico. No, but we are. We're going places. It's a country. We're not going from town to town here. This is this is a country that we're crossing. Uh, but then we can we can work our way up. How does uh, how does Matalan look? Uh, Matalan looks like a flipping flyer, right? Okay, and then you've got La Cruz, which is no, nope, not interesting enough. Uh, but we've got Guadalupe. Uh, is that no? That's a that's a lesser Guadalupe. I think you're going straight to Costa Rica after that. Are you? There's not a lot there. It's uh, that's Costa Rica, a town, not uh, Costa Rica, the country. Uh, let's see you and your details. I think you're going to uh, Culiacan. All right. All of that is billions. Is uh, is what we're in need of there, and. Billions is not what we're making, so I'll uh, I'll get Tepic done, and then I'll see how much cash I got left over. I might do a, a more straightforward route uh, because then it will also remind me which way are we going again. Oh, there is of course south. Yes, Cadoba. Uh, 
yeah, 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 yeah. Cordoba's got uh, got promise. You got a lot of faff on the way there, though. You're gonna you're gonna pay the iron price to get across some of these roads, and by iron I mean money. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just I don't know. It's all so flipping pricey. Uh, we're not going to be going loco in Acapulco before you ask. No, that's not a thing that we're doing. At the moment, I'm just trying to link up two towns that are about an hour away from each other. This is a this is a big job. Yeah, it is. Anyway, I've been Colonel Failure. Uh, short on progress. Big on ideas of what progress could conceivably look like. No, there is there is no ride along on the on the tram, I'm afraid. Otherwise, uh, otherwise we'd do that, and it would be great. But no, we won't. That's El Salvador, the town. Yes, all right, okay. No, it's... Uh, we'd, look, as you zoom out, it's going to tell you the big places. We're going to go to Tepic. Uh, Tepic is the, uh, is the town for us, because we'll, we'll mirror the, the path that this river is taking without ever crossing it, sloping across the, uh, the eastern side... And then, uh, and then keep going up through straight up through the mountains. Yeah, we'll we'll try and go a long way through the mountains. All right, hang on. Go look. Give me a minute, and I'm going to try something. Right. Let's start about here. Uh, how far do I need to be? All right. Okay. We'll start here, and then we'll we'll go as the crow flies as far as we can and see what we can do with the budget that we have in in hand. Uh, right, what's your problem? <clears throat> you were saying you're an inappropriate length. Uh, you're an inappropriate length. Uh, right, yeah. Go on, go on, go on. No, you can't, you can't draw too much at once, which is a bit of a drag. But that's okay. You can do about four clicks at a time. All right, keep going. Yeah. Where are we up to? Uh, 63,000 meters, so that's 30 kilometers, 65 grand. So, so far, it's not costing us horrendous amounts. Wrong length means that I've gone too far and then bent the track a bit. Um, because it, uh, it, it works, it, it works to bend the track for you, which is jolly decent of it. Yeah, keep going. Yeah, never mind wrong length. I want to see how far we can get, uh, as we uh, as we look at it direct on on the map see so i'm just going to draw out a bunch of sort of straight sort of lines and uh, and see where it gets us all right for about 200 million all right you've got a little bit of you've got a bit of tile collision action going on there keep going keep going keep going keep going keep going now obviously 200 million is going to be about 100 kilometers but i i just want to see what it looks like yeah, take it to about there. Right, okay. All right, that's not dreadful. That is more than the need the, the, the space needed to get to Tepic, which means Tepic's not far enough away. No, I think we bypass Tepic. I think we go straight up the mountains from Gua uh, from uh, Guadalajara and, uh, and and make our way up to. Uh, uh, Kulikan. Interesting. All right, there you go. That's your lot. Uh, next time, you'll get to look at some more trams, and I'll go, right, okay, well, I've got uh, seven and a half billion quid in the bank. Let's see what we can do with it. It won't be seven and a half billion. I don't know how far it will get my bank balance in, uh, in seven or eight hours, but I'm going to go out on a limb and say probably not as much as I'd like. There you go. Right, that's all that dealt with. I'm off. All right, thanks for watching. I'll catch you next time. I'll give you some some tram. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what. We'll just we'll just watch these wherever it's gone. These chaps here bimbling away. Full bimble, please, team. Right, turn that off. Yeah, turn this off. Yeah, thanks for watching. Cheerio. Well, there you go. Uh, it's it's going to take an awfully long time to get anywhere with this. Uh, but 
it depends on how you how you decide to invest. Now, I've got a, I've got a suspicion that actually uh, running a, a good length point to point service between two decent population centres is probably a very profitable way to live. The downside is that the the expense in setting it up is going to mean that you've you've then committed to that. The uh, the the benefit you get from building a whole bunch of tram stuff is that actually a whole bunch of tram stuff it pays for itself relatively quickly. So you do actually have some disposable income to do a bit more with. So you could probably do 10, 15, 20 cities with tram setups and if they're all making uh, you know, half a million quid plus a day in uh, in profit, which is actually not that big an ask. Uh, then you've got ten million a day extra coming in, which will allow you to extend your uh, your bigger routes to the point that yeah, you see where that yeah, that could possibly that could possibly pay off. Anyway, I'm definitely going to do one more. Definitely, I want to get this route done, and I will set up one more tram line and then leave the thing running until until i need to use my computer i suppose uh and uh, and and we'll we'll see how we get on but i want to do one big nice fat intercity line that runs a, a a decent lick uh to see if there is any any gold anywhere near the hills uh if they're, if they're even aware of what gold could possibly be so there you go you've got you've got that to i'd say look forward to but uh uh, you know, reluctantly go, oh, go on then, let's have a look, go on, just guys, for the sense of, of completion, I might as well do the next one. And that's, I mean, that's that's what all my success is built on, you know, all of it, all, every shred of success is people reluctantly go, go on then, go on, what you got, go on, there you are.